hello everyone welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new in today's video i have the update for the lord of the rings project pam if you're new to this project i will have everything you need to know linked down below the creator of this project who is Freda, is also linked down below you can follow her on instagram or youtube i'm not really sure if she posted on youtube yet but she's definitely on instagram um, she came up with this Lord of the Rings project Pam and I asked to join her. I have given my own thoughts and ideas for some of the prompts. So it is a prompt based project Pam. So every prompt has something to do with Lord of the Rings. I'm normally not really good at um, prompt based projects, but I've been enjoying this one. Um, it started kind of slow but honestly this month i have quite a few rollouts so i'm excited so let's check out all of my products and let's see what is rolling out so the first prompt is the prompt eowyn this has been in since the beginning and it is um a product you didn't expect to love i rolled in my essence lip care booster lip butter and i want to finish this I did not mark it last time. Uh, yeah, we're about this far. I can fold it over. Um, I think maybe there is still an air bubble in here, but uh, for now, if I squeeze it, product comes out. So I'm, I'm not sure, it might all be product. So this month I've used this 11 times for a total of 45 uses in the project and yeah it looks like we're maybe halfway through maybe not even <laughs> so this i knew this was going to be one for the long haul but this is staying in then also a prompt that rolled over was mary and pippin something fun i rolled in the rival loud and proud eyeshadow palette to do a no pan left behind i have used two shades out of this palette so far last last time i didn't use it at all this time i've used this shimmery green and that shimmery green i could have used them today as i'm wearing green but i just forget about this palette to be honest it is in my everyday makeup drawer but i just forget to use it so i'm thinking about doing a palette bingo using this palette um if you want to see that video please let me know uh, so I can just get a little bit more uses out of this um, but yeah I'm sorry it's 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 slow going um, it is staying in then another slow one this was uh, in for the prompt Aragorn I wrote this in two updates ago I'm not even really sure um, this is in for nine uses I used it once last time and I have not used it since so it is staying in I'm not gonna um no we're not gonna elaborate on that I just didn't use it it is staying in then for the prompt prancing pony this also rolled over from last month I had my essence lip gloss um, I have no idea what lip gloss this is anymore everything has rubbed off um, I put this in for 20 uses. Last time I used it 13 times, so I had to use it 7 more times. Um, I have used it 9 more times even. Um, I'm wearing it right now. Uh, last time we were... Is this gonna focus? At this um, pinky nude line and now we're at the white line. So 9 more uses actually gave me quite a bit of progress. Um, I also tried to kind of scrape down the sides. Yeah, this is rolling out. Uh, I think in the long run I want to finish this, but I'm rolling it out of this project right now. Then another rollover was my Essence Eyebrow Pencil. This was in for the prompt Minds of Moria. I'm not really sure what the rest of the prompt was, I'm sorry. Uh, this is in for 20 uses. I used it three times last time yeah three times and i've used it four times this month <laughs> so 
so it's more than the uses I had last time but it's it's going slow uh, again I just forget to use this um, so it's gonna stay in for a while I guess which is okay it's fine and then these prompts all rolled in last update the first one is my precious um, again I'm not really sure what the rest of the prompt was but I rolled in my ABH Norvina palette for a no pan left behind style um, product I have used every shadow see my sticky note once with the exception of soul which is right here and rose gold which is right there uh, rose gold was also in my pan those eyeshadow so uh, yeah it, mm. I mark those uses as well so all the other shades I, I've used once so this is rolling out then for Mount Doom I rolled in my Revolution Matte Balm Liquid Lip in the shade Clueless Fuchsia for nine uses and I have currently used it three times so six more uses um, there is a slight bit of windowing starting to happen here but I mean yeah I, I didn't mark it or anything nine uses is not gonna give me a huge difference I think so uh, I'm gonna have to use it six more th times and then I can roll it up then for the prompt Sam I do remember this was something a friend gave you I rolled in my makeup revolution soft radiance eyeshadow palette again for no pan left behind and i've used all of these shades once i think i did two looks one look using this in the crease this on the inner part of my lid this on the outer part of my lid um and then this on the lower lash line this as an inner corner highlight and then the second look was a combination of this and this in my crease and outer corner and then this in the outer corner and I used a gold on the inner third of my lid so it was quite an easy one um, it is rolling out and then last I rolled in mm, I think it was the prompt a man an elf and a dwarf so a trio and I rolled in my essence choose your glow highlighter palette this is the only trio that I have in my collection as of right now it is three highlighters and I set myself the goal to use each highlighter five times I have used the summer glow and major glow five times each and then candlelit glow I actually used eight times I did really enjoy that one um, so this is also rolling out so we have one two three four rollouts which means we're gonna roll four new prompts I have the wheel here. I have all my prompts available. Um, I did not take out the ones that I've completed. So we're just gonna roll for four new prompts. You're not gonna be able to see this, but this is as proof that I'm rolling. The first prompt is Proudfoot, a foot care item. Oh, okay, I have to, I'm gonna have to think about that one. Then we have a long one Gimli something bold or a product that is small or easily used up in your collection okay I'm trying not to worry about it too much I'll just figure it out later then the Shire something that gives you comfort to use or a favorite product okay and the last one is ring of power slash the one ring expose the ring of pan or something you should throw away but you just cannot part with it okay um i'm gonna think about that and i will be right back with my product okay i have thought about this i'm gonna re-roll for the foot care item because i don't know what to use uh, mm. I, just, I don't have any specific care products. I could roll in a lotion. I, just, I 
no I don't want that on my feet so we're gonna do Faramir a dupe of a product either a great dupe or a disappointing one how oh, poor Faramir okay I'm gonna check again and be right back I figured it out this was not easy <laughs> but uh yeah I stand behind my choices I think for the prompt gimli I've gone with easily used up and I'm rolling in my glam shop Z colorum eyeshadow palette if you can read that <laughs> and this has a matte beige shade in there that I'm currently working on just on my own to use up I actually want to use this up and see if I can depot these pans um, and I thought if I use this up and then try to get the pan out it doesn't matter if I break it or whatever um, and I have a lot of these matte beige eyeshadows that I just need to work through so uh, this is gonna be rolling in for using up is it gonna be the easiest I don't think so I feel like it's gonna take me quite a while to completely use this up but we shall see that's it for Gimli then for the Shire a favorite product I actually decided to go for the Viseart Petit Four um, peach palette this is what it looks like I have only used this once and I've loved it. Uh, this is the inside looks like. It's a very, very nice palette. Very easy, one and done. Um, eyeshadow look is what you get out of this. It's on the lid, it's in the crease. Outer V and then this on the lid. So it's very easy to use. Um, and I really, really enjoyed it the first time I used it. And I want to start using it more. So I'm going to roll this in for five uses then this one was hard for the ring of power something that you either should throw away but you cannot part with or something to expose the ring of the pan of now i have a couple of powder products that probably have the ring in the middle of the pan but it's gonna take me forever to get that visible so i opted for something you should part with but you can't um, and I'm rolling in my Revolution Bronze and Glow um, palette. This only has the highlighter left. As you can see, I have used the crap out of this. Um, it is very old. It is very old. The packaging is broken. Um, it doesn't close properly anymore. But I just... Uh, a part of me wants to finish this so badly and another part of me is like that's gonna take ages just to get rid of it um so we're rolling it into this project i think i'm gonna do 15 uses okay that's scary but i'm gonna do 15 uses and the reason that's scary is because for farmer a dupe i'm rolling in back this uh essence to your low palette because this I think is sort of a dupe for the what are they called that highlighter palette the hourglass that's it the hourglass highlighter palette I feel like this is very very based off of that I might be wrong I'm not really sure I've wanted that highlighter palette from hourglass for ages um, I'm glad I bought this <laughs> I still want it though but we're rolling this in I am actually going to set a goal for only this highlighter and that one because this is just too dark. I've been mixing it last time with that one just to get my uses out of it but I didn't really enjoy it. Uh, maybe when I get a tan I can use it but I just I always get sunburn and that's it. Um, so we're following in these two highlighters. And I'm for these also going to do 10 uses each. Let's just see how that works out. So, pretty sure my highlighters are not going to roll out next time. Or maybe one of the two is. 
because that's a lot of highlighter to be working on but <laughs> it is what it is uh this was my update i hope you enjoyed it if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and i will hopefully see you in my next video bye